Have you ever wondered where to find the most enchanting gardens in Paris? Whether you're a nature lover, history enthusiast, or just someone looking for a serene escape from the bustling city, Paris offers a wealth of stunning gardens that are sure to captivate you. From hidden gems to world-famous landscapes, join us as we explore 10 must-visit gardens in the City of Light. Let's embark on a journey through these green paradises that promise beauty, tranquility, and a touch of Parisian magic. Number one, the interior garden at Petit Palais. Our first stop is the interior garden at Petit Palais. Nestled in the bustling 8th arrondissement, just a few minutes from the ever-popular Champs-Élysées, this garden is a hidden oasis. Despite its central location, it's often overlooked by tourists. The garden's semicircular courtyard is adorned with lush greenery, mosaic-lined pools, and striking columns. Adding to its charm, a fresco painted by Paul Baudouin graces the space. This garden isn't just a feast for the eyes, it's also a unique venue available for private functions. Imagine hosting an unforgettable party in this serene and artistic setting. Number two, the gardens at Versailles. Next, we head to the iconic gardens at Versailles. While not exactly a secret, these gardens are undeniably some of the most magnificent in the world. A short RER train ride from central Paris takes you to the former residence of Marie Antoinette and Louis XVI. Spanning an impressive 2,000 acres, the gardens took 40 years to complete. They feature a network of canals, geometrically arranged hedges, vast woodlands, grand ponds, and over 400 sculptures. The intricate design and sheer scale of the gardens are truly awe-inspiring. Number three, the sculpture garden at the Musée Rodin. In the seventh arrondissement, near Les Invalides, lies another gem, the sculpture garden at the Musée Rodin. This garden is a delightful fusion of art and nature. Gravel pathways meander through manicured hedges and topiary, interspersed with bronze sculptures by Auguste Rodin, including famous pieces like The Thinker and Ugolino and His Sons. The Eiffel Tower peeks through the trees, adding a quintessentially Parisian touch to the serene atmosphere. Number four, Père Lachaise Cemetery. It might seem unusual to include a cemetery in this list, but Père Lachaise Cemetery is no ordinary burial ground. Located in the northeast of Paris, this 44-hectare space is a beautiful blend of history and nature. As the final resting place of cultural icons such as Oscar Wilde, Edith Piaf, and Jim Morrison, the cemetery is steeped in history. The tranquil paths, shaded by ancient trees, offer a peaceful retreat from the city's hustle and bustle. In addition to its historical significance, Père Lachaise is a haven for wildlife, with numerous birds and small animals calling it home. The cemetery's serene atmosphere, combined with its rich history, makes it a must-visit destination for anyone exploring Paris. A stroll through Père Lachaise is not just a journey through the past, but also an opportunity to enjoy the natural beauty and tranquility that this unique location offers. Number 5. Les Buttes Chaumont Nestled in the 19th arrondissement, Parc des Buttes Chaumont is a 61-acre public park, boasting a unique hilly landscape. Built upon former gypsum quarries, the park offers stunning elevation changes and captivating views, particularly of Montmartre. Inaugurated in 1867, it's a masterpiece of landscape design, showcasing a variety of terrains that evoke French regions, from the cliffs of Etretat to Alpine meadows. The park's crown jewel is the Temple de la Sibylle, a miniature Roman temple perched on a clifftop island in the center of a vast artificial lake. Visitors can explore the network of pathways, lose themselves in the lush greenery, and enjoy the serenity of the waterfalls and caves scattered throughout. The park also features a suspended bridge and plenty of space for picnics, leisure activities, and escaping the urban buzz. Number six, Jardin de Luxembourg. The Jardin de Luxembourg is another must visit. Located in the sixth arrondissement, the 61 acre garden surrounds the magnificent Luxembourg Palace, once home to Queen Marie de Medici. Inspired by the Boboli Gardens in Florence, it is divided into a formal French garden and a more relaxed English garden with a large central fountain known as the Grand Bassin. Visitors can enjoy various activities, from sailing remote control boats on the fountain to playing tennis or chess. For those seeking relaxation, there are plenty of picturesque spots to sit and soak in the beauty. Number seven, Le Bois de Boulogne. Le Bois de Boulogne is a sprawling 8.5 square kilometer public park on the western edge of Paris. Once a royal hunting ground, it's now a major recreational area. The park boasts a large lake for boating, a Shakespeare garden, a renowned rose garden, and a horse racing track. Wooded areas provide peaceful walks, while open spaces offer opportunities for picnics, biking, and sports. Le Bois de Boulogne also features amusement parks, restaurants, and theaters. 
With its diverse offerings, it's a perfect escape from the city bustle for families, couples, and nature enthusiasts. Number eight, Jardin des Tuileries. A visit to Paris wouldn't be complete without a stroll through the Jardin des Tuileries. Redesigned in 1664 by royal landscape architect André Le Nôtre, this garden is a historical masterpiece. Despite the Tuileries Palace being burned down in 1871, the gardens remain a favorite spot for both locals and tourists. The garden's Grand Couvert is a shaded area lined with trees, while the Grand Carré features vibrant flower beds, ponds, and neatly trimmed box hedges. Walking from the Place de la Concorde to the Musée de l'Orangerie, where Monet's water lilies are displayed, offers a scenic and culturally rich experience. Number nine, La Coulée Verte. For a unique perspective of Paris, explore La Coulée Verte. This elevated linear park follows an old railway line from Bastille to the Bois de Vincennes. Spanning 4.5 kilometers, the path traverses a series of gardens, tunnels, and viaducts, including the Via Duc des Arts, now home to various artisans and craftspeople. The mix of elevated views and lush greenery makes La Coulée Verte a refreshing way to see the city from above. Number 10, Parc Monceau. Parc Monceau is an 8.5 hectare public park in central Paris, known for its formal landscaping and elegant atmosphere. Originally an 18th century private garden, it became a public park in the 19th century. Parc Monceau features manicured lawns, flower beds, a picturesque rotunda, and a ruined Egyptian style pyramid. Visitors can stroll along winding paths, admire sculptures, or relax by the ornamental pond. The park also boasts a miniature train ride and a carousel, making it a favorite among families. Parc Monceau offers a peaceful oasis amidst the urban landscape, perfect for a leisurely walk or escape from the city. Paris is renowned for its art, history, and cuisine, but its gardens are equally deserving of attention. From grand palatial gardens to hidden urban oases, each offers a unique blend of beauty and tranquility. Whether you're seeking a peaceful retreat, a cultural adventure, or simply a picturesque spot to relax, these 10 gardens provide an array of enchanting experiences. So next time you find yourself in Paris, take a break from the usual attractions and immerse yourself in the city's verdant wonders. If you enjoyed this video, then don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more amazing content. Thanks for watching.